today we have quite an interesting case. It's a wonderful lady, 54 year old, who as a child underwent uh, female genital mutilation in which her clitoris was uh, excised and also the labia minor or the smaller lips were also excised. So what are we going to do here? She previously had some reconstruction attempted done that did not work where they tried to exteriorize the clitoris again, but it's retracted. So I want to try and go and bring it out and tell it to stay right out where it needs to be. She also wanted a little bit of work, if possible, done to give her a semblance of some minor lips, the small labia, which previously had been excised. So we're going to go in and see if we can at least give her some loose looking skin that will mimic the labia minora, the minor lips, to give her a cosmetic look, but also to enhance her sexual excitement during the act. Thank you very much. Welcome to AJ's Theatre. Today we're going to be doing a reconstructive clitoral plasty together with uh, labia plasty. This is uh, a patient who had previous female genital mutilation um, with uh, the labia was excised and also the clitoris was excised. A primary repair, previous repair was attempted uh, to exteriorize her clitoris, but that broke down and retracted again. So we're going to be exteriorizing it again and ensuring it stays put together with uh, using a flat method to recreate somewhat uh, visible labia minora on her. So this is going to be very interesting. Welcome. Okay, we are done. This was an interesting, tricky one. The reason being she had previously had uh, an attempt at uh, repair and there was retraction. So there was a very, very short clitoral stamp that was really deep inside. We managed to at least uh, bring it superficial, make it a bit more superficial. So she'll heal that way. The amount of uh, tissue available for repair and reconstruction of new labia, there's very little tissue there. So it would actually be more mutilation. So we decided not to do that. But what at least we do have is that the clitoris has come a bit more superficial. That should be a bit more uh, excitable. It's now a bit more excitable. It will reach the center of action, so to speak. We've also done um, platelet-rich plasma injection, the O-shot, around the clitoral area, and of course in the anterior vaginal wall at the famed or infamous G-spot. And so we hope that she'll have a much better life from now on. Thank you very much. Thank you.